Hi, this is Nelson Ranch. So the uh, Tachyon event is on, and uh, people are preparing for the uh, League of Heroes. Uh, the League of Heroes is the Kyoto 2200. It's basically the uh, uh, Elizabeth Cup. Uh, <coughs> So I have actually began to train uh, parents. So this is one parent for runners. Uh, I'm gonna use this parent here for runners. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Long mid distance, two on dirt. I mean not dirt. Two on turf, uh, grass, and then this for. One, two, three, four, five, six on mid distance and two on runners. So, you know, in the perfect uh, perfect case scenario, I would get a triple uh, thing where it's uh, runner S, mid distance S, and uh, uh, grass S. Don't think that'll happen, but you know, that'll be nice. Uh, I don't really care about the blues at this point because this scenario has proven that you can actually get to max. Uh, this is a uh, UC4 Tomomo Cross. She's at 1750 speed, almost 1700 stamina, almost 1500 power, and 1220 uh, int and 1070 guts. I mean, it's like you're you're pretty much like pushing the limits here. So uh, the blues are less important. I think the only important blues at this point is the uh, is the guts. If I had like, I think this one had the speed three. Speed three and speed three. So that's speed nine and guts, guts, and guts. So if I had done actually like uh, 18 guts, I probably would have gotten the 1200 guts and speed 1750. Um, I should have pushed for more speed, but I was like, ah, this is good enough. But anyway, the point is, stats are going to be pretty easy to get. Uh, with the current uh, scenario. The current Mecha Uma Musume scenario is very, very strong. Um, so you're going to pretty much cap the stats. And what's going to be important, I think, is skill points. Um, this uh, Gentle Donna uh, did not get sharpness, but she got uh, skill point 4900 by running 22 races. So I think that's the solution. You basically have to run a lot of races. And if you run a lot of races, you'll get high skill points. Um, so she has this uh, TM Opera O that's got speed, speed, and stamina. And this one is guts, guts, and guts. And with this high guts, I got, you know, high guts here. Uh, towards the end of the run, I basically started putting, started doing guts training uh, to get the guts up. I wasn't doing stamina training, even though if the stamina was blinking, because for mid-distance, high stamina isn't really going to help you that much. The stamina gimmick doesn't help that much, and I would actually prefer to have a higher guts, so that's why I did this. So she's got almost maxed out the speed. She's got, she's maxed out her power. She's got good int. The stamina is fine, and the guts is fine, so I could probably run her as is. The only thing is she doesn't have sharpness, so I would probably want to do Gentle Donna one more time for sharpness. This is the Mariano Top Gun that actually did get sharpness, I believe. Um, but uh, no, no, she, she didn't also get sharpness either, so I have to actually do this one one more time for sharpness. Um, and, you know, she has high stamina but low guts, and I'm not too happy about that. This Kitasan Black got, uh, or Kitasan White, I guess, at this point, got sharpness, but she doesn't get the mid distance S, so I have to do her to get mid distance S. So uh, for this Elizabeth Cup, I'm going to do uh, two runners and a leader. So the two runners are Kitasan White and this Mayana Top Gun, and the leader is obviously going to be this uh, Gentle Donna. So now the question is to Arima Kinen. Uh, because the. Agnes Tachyon event is going on, and I've got two more reports left over. Right, it's all completely finished. So I've got two more reports left, um, and I'm planning on using the two reports for the upcoming Ari Makinen in December. Uh, I, I put more effort into the uh, Champions meetings than to the League of Heroes. If I can get Platinum 4 in League of Heroes, I'll be happy. If I can get into, like, you know, top 300 in League of Heroes, I'll be ecstatic. I don't think I will, but, you know, you have to be, like, you have to, like, really intensely work at this to 
get in the top 96, and when you don't get in the top 96, meaning you can get a chance in getting in the top 300. So if you're like me and you aim for the top 300, you're going to get in the top 300. Uh, but anyway, <clears throat> regardless. Um... I'm planning on working on the Arima Kinen. The Arima Kinen is going to be an interesting race. Many characters are going to have a really good chance of doing well in the Arima Kinen. Um, if you are a runner, I think obviously... Uh, uh, or let's do Onige first. If you are an Onige runner, uh, then... This Midget of Palmer is probably your best bet. Uh, if you're going to send out a runner, your best bet is probably going to be this version of Kitasan Black, the Kitasan Red version. Or, uh, because her unique skill is just crazy strong, or it's going to be this uh, Man of Top Gun, uh, which is here somewhere. Uh, the new Halloween Mayano Top Gun will also be another really good candidate for a runner, I think. Um, and uh, as usual, I think a little bit weaker, but this uh, Seigun Sky would also be a pretty good candidate for uh, Arima Kiren as a runner as well. For leaders, I think the top leader is going to be Gentle Donna. Uh, Gentle Donna, where are you? She is towards the back. Here she is. She's probably going to be the best character, I think, uh, for uh, uh, leaders. Uh, other leaders would probably include, char almost any leaders would do well, but uh, I think, uh, especially because of the new Nanita Bryan speed card. Um, but, you know, personally, I think this Super Creek will do well, uh, um, and other characters uh, would uh, do well as leaders. So, uh, where she go? I don't have her. Uh, this version of uh, uh, Mr. McQueen, I think, will also do well um, because now you can actually stick. Uh, uh, <coughs> what's her name? Uh, well, you could always stick that in through uh, int, so you can actually stick uh, the acceleration skill through uh, the. Uh, TM Opro card, and then you can use the Narita Bryan card for uh, more uh, more speed skills. So <clears throat> I think she would be good. Um, I, you know, I think this uh, version of Tokai Teo would also be very good because of the unique skill. For the, the betweeners, obviously the best candidates are going to be uh, uh, what's her name. Uh, where are you? Sakura Laurel. She's going to be a great candidate, uh, especially because she's got Mile C. Another really good candidate will probably be... Uh, 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 this version of Measure of Bright. So any character that's got Mile C or better, Mile A, B, or C, is going to do really well because uh, you can run the races to actually get a chance to accumulate uh, skill points. If your mile is D or below, it's going to be a lot harder, I think. Um, but this Midget of Bright, I think, is going to do quite well. I'm actually wondering if this Midget of Bright will do really well. And I hope she can. Um, where, is she, where are you? Um, this version. I'm wondering if this version of Metro Bright would do really well because of the this gimmick. So depending on how much stamina you have, uh, she can actually, uh, you know, keep, uh, you know, running. Uh, <laughs> so weirdly enough, if you can actually get like stam 1700 and if you actually do a lot of recovery skills like she has here, I think it might actually be possible to basically have this skill just go on all the way the you know, to the end, which is <laughs> just kind of insane. Uh, but if that's possible, then, you know, she might actually be a really, really good candidate to, uh, she might be a really, really strong candidate. And because she's a, you know, betweener or chaser, you can actually use either skill as a betweener or chaser. Uh, for chasers, uh, obviously, uh, I think uh, this version of Gold Ship is going to do well because of this skill. Uh, she's got the gold version of this skill. Um, so Gold Ship, um, I think, uh, you know, uh, any character uh, th that you can actually stick uh, 
the Narita Taishin card in will do better. Narita Taishin herself, therefore, isn't going to do as well, unfortunately. But even for characters who already have, you know, imminent shadow, like Narita Taishin, but Narita Taishin is going to do it. But for characters like Inari One or for Mr. CB, where are you, Mr. CB? Um, she should be somewhere in here. There she is. Uh, you can use the int Narita Taishin card to actually give you the speed increase, and that will actually give them an advantage. So these characters might do better. Um, so I don't know who I want to send out for the Ari Makinen. I'm really torn on this. Um, Tamamo Cross already run for me, so I'm pretty okay. I don't think I'm going to need to send out Tamamo Cross. Um, and uh, what's her name? Um, Kichi Miracle also won the Ari Makinen for me, so I'm actually okay with not sending them out, which means I kind of want to send out Oguri as a betweener, so I'm going to lose this, but you know, I'm going to have enough stamina so this doesn't matter, this is, you know, this will be a dead skill, but I want to send out Oguri uh, and Inari <laughs> as a chaser, so chaser, betweener Oguri, and leader Ninja Super Creek. So this is one possibility. So this trio from, uh, what's her name? Uh, from uh, uh, Cinderella Grey. Or I'm thinking of the possibility of doing uh, <coughs> Onige Palmer. I did Onige Palmer a long time ago. Uh, I think in the second time Dari Makinen was ran, and I lost when I sent out Onige Palmer. So uh, it wasn't this version of Palmer. It was this version of Palmer. Uh, and I've wanted to, you know, re, you know, do it one more time. So I actually put in a lot of hint books into this version of Palmer. Uh, but this is the, uh, uh, I think the second Anima Kinen that I sent her out, and there was another Onige, and they both sank. So it really pissed me off. <laughs> so Palmer. Um, and if I'm going to send out Palmer, then it might make sense to just send out uh, Mariano Top Gun and uh, Kitasan Red. So a triple runner team, or what I could do is I could send out Palmer and I could send out Ryan, I think. Uh, this Ryan. Because this skill actually will work in the Ari Makinen. Uh, so uh, this skill won't work, but that's fine because this skill is, you know, it's a, it's a medium distance skill, so it's pointless. So I'm just going to drop that skill. And instead, um, I'll pick this one. Um, right, this Ryan, uh, Palmer, and where are you? I might send out either this McQueen or this McQueen. <laughs> either that, or uh, I might go crazy and decide to do, uh, uh, I might actually use a ticket and get this McQueen. And I might actually do a, a triple Mejido team. Uh, Mejido McQueen, Mejido Palmer, and Mejido Ryan. And uh, Mejido Palmer is the only Mejido that's one out of the three. <laughs> um, but, it, you know, I might actually send out, uh, I could also send out uh, Mejido Lamone as well, right? I could send her out too. Uh, although, unfortunately for her, both of these skills are mid distance, so they don't, they don't, they won't work. Uh, so that's the only problem with sending out Mejido Lamone. Uh, losing one gold skill, I think, is tolerable, but losing both is kind of rough, which means that, you know, Mejido Arden uh, is going to lose uh, this skill. This is a medium distance skill, so she only have this skill. But this is a recovery skill, and with the current Mecha Uma Musume, we can cast Stamina 1700. Frick, I don't need a recovery skill. <laughs> um, <clears throat> In which case, uh, it might be uh, this Arden, but the, even this Arden, I believe, is... Uh, I don't know, what does this Arden have? Let's find out. Okay, can... The dance version of Mejido Arden will have... Here it is. Yeah, she has another recovery skill as well, which I don't need. <laughs> Uh, oh, but I suppose this actually turns into a speed skill. Uh, yeah, this actually might not be bad. Uh, and then what's the other skill? 
This is a median distance scale. R, R. So this R, R then is for median distance. <laughs> um. <clears throat> so who will I send out? <laughs> and Dover's, yeah, she doesn't have a long distance ability to, she doesn't have the ability to run long distances. I can't do Dover. Uh, e is okay, and D is fine. <sighs> Well, there you go. All right. Take it easy.